Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Surviving Mars. This is the 1075% difficulty playthrough with no competitors. So we've got a uh, meteor storm coming, right? And we've got some stuff that's damaged, right? But we're uh, making progress on terraforming. Um, so... Uh, once the atmosphere gets up past 50%, uh, dust storms should go away. And uh, that should uh, basically eliminate the major uh, source of, uh, of problems, right? Uh, for maintenance. Um, and once we hit 50% uh, uh, temperature, uh, we should uh, stop getting cold waves. And that will uh, also be uh, helpful. Uh, now, as the atmosphere goes up, these get uh, more effective, and these get um, less effective, right? Uh, and that's fine. Uh, anyway, the goal here is to get to the point where we can open the domes, and that's going to be, be basically, uh, I'm going to call that basically a win. And that means we need to get to 93% atmosphere, if I remember correctly. And 50% uh, temperature. Uh, so, uh, as you can see here, uh, we've got um, a, a certain amount of atmospheric loss. Um, and uh, and we're, we're, so at some point, we're going to have to have more carbonate processors. Or equivalent to, uh, to get uh, the atmosphere to, uh, uh, to stay. And we have here a rocket that's ready to land, so uh, let's land it. Um, right. Uh, let's up the tempo so things move a little bit faster. Um, okay. Now we've got uh, uh, Curtato's rocket coming, and uh, we've got a couple sols before the high speed comm satellite goes up. And who died? It's a renegade. Right. Well, we're starving the renegades out, so, you know, that's fine. Uh, right. Uh, so what we want to do is, uh, I guess, uh, let things uh, tick along for a bit here and, uh, and see what's doing. Now, what's uh, we're researching core heat convector. Uh, which, uh, oh, we did an export of rare metals, which uh, got us 2.4 billion. Like, now we don't have a cash issue. If we end up with any kind of uh, supply shortage, uh, we can just uh, grab it from Earth with the space elevator, which is over here. And that, uh, that makes basically all the difference. So basically, once you get the space elevator and the mohole, uh, you're pretty much uh, set. Uh, now, uh, let's see here. We're currently, uh, producing more waste rock than we're burning. So, uh, I think we probably want another, um, another one of these. Uh, but we need to build up concrete first. Uh, so that's our, our current, uh, issue. It is a lack of concrete. So how much are we making? 24. We want to be making more. Uh, okay, so, uh, what we can do is, uh, well, we could find another concrete deposit and use that. We're using the nano refining, uh, thing because we got that breakthrough. Uh, 14 colonists. Uh, why are 14 starving? Um, uh, right. Okay, let's just take a look here. We have 304 food. And we have this thing is uh, doing its thing. Um, right. And uh, what... Oh, this... Uh, yeah, we can land the cure potatoes. Um, okay. I think we're okay for food. But, uh, because this is going to dump some food in, 
Um, I th did I build a second ranch? Or is it just the one? Yeah, we did another export. Um, just have the one ranch by the look of it. Yeah. Looks like. Well, in that case, I'm going to go in here. And go in here. And... Uh, outside ranch. Yep. And... Wait a minute. Let's see. You have unemployed 8. You have unemployed 15. Okay. Well, let's go for a outside ranch and we will attach it here. No. We won't because there's no room. We will attach it to something somewhere. Well, we got the passage so we can get workers from this dome, but we could just stick it over here. You know, that might be the thing to do. Let's uh, turn it around so we can look. Well, if we put it here... Yeah, we'll put it here. Uh, okay, now that's going to need a... Uh, uh, whatchamacallit, a pipe. Uh, which can go here. Yeah. Okay. Good. That, that should... Uh... Now, do, do we have... Yeah, we're adjacent to the Moxie, right? Well, we're constructing it. We'll see if it has power. Um, looks like it does. Now, we'll go in here and we'll change that to cows. Okay. Good. Uh, so far, so good. Uh, we just, uh, did a cure potatoes export, so, you know, there's that. Uh, right. Uh, we got a meteor storm ongoing. Where is it? Over here. Okay. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Um, what I could do, I've got the cash. I could just bring in some food uh, if I wanted to. But I don't think I need to. So let's try being self-sufficient here. Uh, we haven't had to... Im oh, wait, no, I can't import food. Can I? I've got that game rule set up. Um... Uh, space elevator. Yeah, yeah, I've got the, uh, I've got that rule set up. Right, okay. Uh, okay, so that's fine. Uh, I can't import food. That could get dicey. Uh, how's this doing? It's got a long way to go, but these things are doing, uh, cover crops, yeah. And what are you doing? Cure potatoes. Cover crops. Well, we're going to change this to uh, quinoa, right? Uh, 22 in two sols. That's 11 per sol. We did the high speed comm satellite. Um, uh, and that's two sols. Uh, soy is. Yeah. We're going to change that to quinoa here. Yeah. Uh, right. Okay. So we're going to grow quinoa in that one. And then we'll go over here. And we're growing cure potatoes. We'll do cover crop. Okay. Yeah. Um, high speed comm. Okay, now we're doing a thousand sponsor research per uh, sol. Uh, core heat convector is coming along. Uh, let's uh, 
let's jump in here and uh, just take a look here. Uh, the large scale excavation, the excavator, uh, that uh, uh, that allows us to uh, make uh, concrete. So let's just uh, grab that and uh, we'll do more outsourcing. Okay. Meanwhile, we'll observe the uh, meteors coming in and uh, smashing into the ground. Uh, we're going to land the rocket. And uh, what I should probably do is uh, uh, go in here and uh, stick another one of these up here. Yeah, because you definitely don't want to have to repair a wonder. Uh, you definitely don't. Okay, now we're going to go in here and we're going to turn off the export of uh, rare metals. Um, why? Because the uh, uh, you know, we're, we've uh, used up our uh, backlog of them. So let's let that uh, build up again. Uh, and and by, by doing that, you know, you can always turn it back on and it'll just export a whole batch of them all at once, right? Um, right. Okay, now how are we uh, doing here? Uh, core heat convector, 41%. Um, We've got a stack of unemployed people, so uh, what we've got a bunch of unemployed people here, here, no, here. Okay, I'm going to build a. Uh, I'm going to see if I can build some science stuff. I can't remember if I got the tech for that yet, and I just looked at the techs. Well, it's going to be over here. Martian Research Lab. Yeah, I don't have the Hawk, the Hawking Institute yet. Okay. Um, right. Well, if I go and look in here. Well, no, I'll just let that uh, that continue. Okay. Uh, let's just take a look up here. We don't have anything fancy we can do up here, do we? Well, we could capture uh, ice asteroids. Yeah, let's do that. If we can get the water level up, then, uh, you know, there's that too, right? Uh, that could be uh, uh, beneficial. I never really looked at what the uh, the uh, laser uh, th stuff looks like from up up at the uh, orbital view. Um, right. Yeah. Well, you can actually see the lasers from up there. That's kind of cool. Obviously, they're not lasers if you can see them. But, <laughs> yeah. Uh, right. We have... Okay, we have 134 concrete now. Uh, yeah, so we are building up concrete. That's good. Uh, we've got a ridiculous amount of electronics coming in, a ridiculous amount of those, a ridiculous amount of polymers, so we can actually do stuff with all of this. Uh, the meteors are almost done. Uh, food is not dropping as much as it uh, could. Uh, it could it could be. Um, yeah, we're about... A third of the way, 40% of the way on that ranch. And we're about 20% of the way on that one. Uh, okay. That's the thing. It takes a long time to raise the cattle, but they produce a lot. And I did the math a while back, and it turned out to be the most lucrative uh, method of uh, doing that. Uh, but no, we're up over 400 uh, colonists. Uh, so now we've hit the snowball, uh, the real snowball here. Uh, and that, uh, uh, and once the, we can open the domes, it gets real easy to, uh, uh, to, uh, well, rejigger everything so that, 
so that we can uh, house everybody and so on. Um, yeah. Uh, and I think uh, if, if we were to uh, look back through the uh, series, we'd find that the construction of the Hanging Gardens uh, was the turning point. Uh, when we started to be able to uh, get enough colonists going. And uh, once we did that, uh, it's been basically uh, uh, an exercise in, uh, uh, in getting, uh, you know, as much stuff uh, uh, sorted out as uh, possible. Okay, we're going to change that to quinoa. And that to uh, quinoa as well. Yeah. Uh, so we'll just have one farm growing cure potatoes. We don't need the exports. So uh, we might as well be growing food instead. And here, uh, yeah, we've got... Uh, yeah, it takes 12 sols. Uh, so uh, we have... Uh, Yeah, we're 55%, so we're halfway through. Uh, we've got another six sols. Uh, so we definitely need to get food off of the uh, farms, right? Now, we do get a little bit of food out of cover crops. Uh, but quinoa is going to give us more. And, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's basically uh, the reason I'm switching. Because you don't get any food out of cure potatoes either. So... Uh, but you definitely want the maximum fertility, which is why I didn't just replace the cover crops, right? Uh, quinoa doesn't leach the ground, so I'll be able to turn off cover crops on uh, any of these that are actually growing uh, quinoa uh, when it starts. Cover crops take uh, five sols, yeah. Uh, so we're going to get a, a, f a little bit of food from the cover crops. And then two sols after that, we'll get more food from the uh, quinoa. We have new planetary anomalies. What have we got? New techs. That doesn't seem useful. Uh, resources, maybe. Uh, resources. Unknown. Let's go check out unknown. Okay. Yeah. Unknown seems like the thing to do. Uh, what's this? Ice asteroids. Well, that's that's the uh, next... Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, we'll see what Unknown has to say. Like, we can take the risk on the rocket. Uh, we've got cash. We should be able to handle anything that pops up. So, uh, we'll see what Unknown is. I notice it still hasn't popped up the... Uh, a uh, new uh, colony uh, arrival event. Forty-six percent uh, atmosphere, forty-two percent. Yeah. Um. Okay. Expedition encountered arrival colony. Da 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 da. We'll make amends. A new breakthrough tech. Uh, okay. What is it? Neural empathy. Empaths raise the morale of all colonists in the dome. The effect stacks with other empaths. Huh. Okay, I don't think I've ever seen that one. Um, right. Well, let's just take a look at the population. We have seven renegades. Uh, how many people? We've got 13 out of 12 in here. Must be a bunch of idiots. Let's check in on the command center here. We'll look under colonists. Uh... We'll look here under idiot. 
Uh, entire colony. Yeah. No idiots. Um, okay. Colonists. Who are in here? Okay. Oh, we have no... We have homelessness. Ah. That would be the problem. Okay, we're going to... No, no, we're going to click on here. And we're going to go in here. No. We're going to go in here. Uh, no, here. Let's click on the right thing, shall we? And we're going to build apartments. Let's use a different one. Okay, yeah, we'll go with that. Um, actually, we want to build a couple of those. Uh, no. Uh, yeah, we'll build that one. And... Yeah, I'll build one of those, just because they look different. Okay, so we'll build those, and uh, that should... Um, okay, so we've uh, got a little bit of food out of here. Now we're growing quinoa. Uh, we'll do a nun on there now. And we'll do a nun on there. And here we've switched to quinoa, so we'll do a nun there. So, yeah, we've got another soul. We'll get some food out of that. Milestone achieved. First rainfall. Ah. Okay. We're down to 90 food. Uh, so we're going to have a little bit of complaint about uh, starving. Uh... And that's fine. I'm going to have to build another dome by the look of it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to need to build another dome. Uh, right. Uh, you know what? I'm going to build another one of these in here. Yeah. Whoops. Uh, okay, so, so we can have some more housing, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, you are the... You are... Right, you're the one that went to that place that time. Okay, you can land here. We have completed research on core heat convector. Uh, now let's uh, take a look in here. We're doing Sterling Generator, and then we're doing... Okay, what we want to do is uh, get large-scale excavation up to the top. Yep. Okay. Now, can we... No, we're still busy on outsourcing okay no no we're gonna go in here also and uh, uh, what is it uh, we're gonna grab that one first yeah okay uh, that'll give us something we can do with our uh, colonists right uh, meantime let's take a look here under uh, terraforming carbonate pr uh, processor. Yeah. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll stick another one of these up. I don't know, say here. Yeah, we'll stick one of them up there. Now that needs 160 concrete, so that's going to be a uh, fair uh, 
uh, a fair amount of uh, constructing going on there but we will produce the concrete fast enough so uh, it won't be too big of a problem I'm building another one of those so that uh, this can uh, go up faster because we're losing half of the production right out the uh, to space right now right uh, now of course this is not how actual terraforming would go actual terraforming would uh, would involve something a little bit uh, more uh, uh, detailed uh, okay so we need uh, another uh, dumping site say like this yeah Uh, and that because uh, we had uh, we had our uh, um, uh, concrete extractor uh, stop working now over here oh yeah we need more drones here let's put let's put 20 drones over there yeah and uh, you you are the curtatoes you are our other rocket okay um right uh we're down to 85 food how's this guy coming along uh that's at 83 uh, percent a couple more saws that'll be fine how are these coming along yeah we've uh we've been uh, growing quinoa right uh okay we have another capture ice asteroids. Let's um, let's go up here and take a look at these. Okay, that's resources, so we'll just send an expedition there. Yeah, send, then we'll go up here, and we'll send another ice asteroids mission. Uh, you know, since we've got nothing really better doing, we might as well, you know, increase the water, right? Um, that just seems like a thing to do. Now, uh, what we're going to also do is we're going to go in here on the uh, space elevator. No, uh, we're going to go in here on the Earth in the space elevator, and we're going to grab... A full load of seeds. Okay, launch. Uh, right. So I think we're almost to the. I think we're at the point where we can grow trees. Um. Okay. We're going to now. Um. What would be over here? Forestation plant. We got thirty polymers from the. Anomaly. Um, so if we put this over here, yeah, we'll put that there. Good. Um, we also want to have a uh, depot for seeds which we're going to stick I don't know say over here and you plant type one mixed trees we need uh, 75% water trees 35% water. Okay. Well, we'll leave it with... Uh, we'll leave it with lichen for the moment. You... Uh, you can land. We have finished the Martian Institute of Science. So what I'm going to... Oh. Yeah, we don't have anywhere to build it, do we? No, we don't. We can make? No, we can't. 
Yeah, we can. You are a research lab. Well, if I do this, and then I do this, then I can go in here, Education, uh, Hawking Institute, uh, we can stick one right here. Yeah. Yeah, because we can fit that in there. That's a grocer. I can move stuff over here. Okay, so we'll uh, grab a uh, services and we'll grab a grocer and we'll put that here and we will get rid of that one. You are a small space bar. Uh, small space bar. You can go there and you can do this. And then I can get rid of the security station there. And I can put a second uh, uh, institute in uh, which if I go over here Hawking Institute come on finish there we go put you here now I can put back the security stations uh, which is over here I can put one of them there and I can put one of them here. Yeah. Okay. So we'll uh, we'll do that. Now this needs. Yeah. Okay. We toxic rain. Uh huh. Now we need concrete, of course. Now you large scale ex excavation is underway now. Now if we go over here, we've got another one of these new techs. Well, let's just send the expedition for new techs and see what it does. I don't think it's going to do anything. Um yeah. Buildings destroyed where? In here. Rebuild. Okay. Uh, we have... Yeah. Okay. Right. Oh, yeah, we have only... Yeah, we don't have any residential slots available, so... We're definitely going to need another dome. Which will be entirely residential. Uh, okay, we... Our uh, ranch has uh, delivered its food. This one will shortly. Oh, we got science out of it. Okay. I wonder what happened if you revealed all the texts. Right. Okay. Uh, so we're going to need to build another dome. So let's take a look at what domes we have. Domes. Megadome. We need gravity engineering for a megadome. Medium dome. We need 120 concrete. Yeah. Uh, well, let's go in here and take a look. Gravity engineering. Gravity engineering. Megadome. Yeah, we'll chuck gravity engineering in there. Okay. We need to get concrete uh, up though. Uh, okay, you can land. Yeah. Okay. Blocking objects. You go over here. Okay. Um, yeah. Okay. Good. Ooh! Now, we have a clear atmosphere. We hit 50% atmosphere, so no more dust storms. Incidentally, uh, when you hit the 50% atmosphere, any ongoing dust storm ends. <laughs> uh, 
uh, at least uh, that's what, what I recall happening. I had a, a mega colossal ridiculous uh, dust storm going when the atmosphere cleared in one game. Uh, same thing happens with the cold waves. Uh, I had one. I had that extended cold waves event, you know, which lasts like half a year. Uh, you know, it lasts like 10, 15 sols. Um, and, uh, you know, like I had that one and uh, it was just getting underway. Uh, the temperature ticked over to 50% and uh, poof, it ended. But anyway, here we go. Blue skies on Mars. Yeah. Uh, so uh, I think that might be a good enough milestone to leave this episode at. Uh, notice that the quality of the light uh, has uh, changed here. Yeah. That's uh, because we have the blue sky, right? Uh, so now we don't have that red tint on the on all, all the light. And it's kind of cool. Uh, what's this? Oh, that's just a, a leftover meteor thing. This thing is ticking along. Uh, I th and look here. We are burning more than we're producing for waste rock at the moment. That's fine. We if we run out of waste rock, there's an easy way to get more. Yeah, that's right. Do a terraforming project. Now, let's uh, go in here. Uh, and we're going to turn on all shifts here. And we're going to turn on all shifts here. Uh, okay, so that's our uh, main services are uh, operational again. Um, what I'm going to do... Hmm... Uh, can I can afford to uh, I can almost afford to get rid of the uh, renegades dome if I just build because I've got unemployed people out the wazoo so I can build how many renegades do I have 14 um, okay well that's fine um, right well let's uh, just tick in here we have one more of these. Needs three officers. If we send the expedition there, I think that clears all of those. Yeah, it does. Uh, okay. Uh, we'll see what the resources are. But anyway, uh, I'm going with the uh, Martian blue sky. Uh, which we can see here. I'm going to call that... Uh, I'm going to pause that. I'm going to call that the end of the episode. And uh, next time around, uh, it'll be getting this up to 93% and uh, this up to 50%. So we, we'll have a little bit of uh, work to do. Uh, and then uh, from there, uh, I'll... Uh, I, I think... Well, from here, I think we've got two episodes maybe three uh before it uh based on the progress uh not sure exactly but uh we're, we're getting there uh we'll hit it will be able we're definitely going to make it to opening the domes so yeah there we go uh that's going to be all for this time so stay healthy uh, don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. After all, there does seem to be a light at the end of the tunnel now. And see you back next time.